let's talk for a moment about risk management. And uh, this is a big deal to me. So I hope you'll you'll just give me and bear with me for a minute while I just give you an update on on how we look at risk management at at Abra. All right. So there's two perspectives on managing risk for generating yield as a CFI com company. The first, of course, has to do with traditional lending, uh, which is often how yield is generated in our space. And the second has to do with DeFi. And I'll talk about both. And DeFi is a big deal right now because we're going to be offering more and more DeFi services to you directly. And we want you to understand how all this works. So in, in the lending world, we basically run a, a team that does nothing but focus on risk management. Now, it may not be clear to many of you what risk management actually means. At its core, risk management basically says, what are the practices that your company is undertaking to protect the funds that you're helping to either oversee, uh, lend, generate yield on, invest, or whatever uh, the appropriate term might be for the business that you're in? So in the case of Abra, we've partnered with Prime Trust, a uh, trust a bank based in uh, the US, to be able to offer a yield for crypto deposits. And as such, uh, Abra manages the process on, on their behalf of generating that yield. And we have several different forms of risk oversight that we do. Uh, at the same time, and we have a committee of folks, which I sit on, uh, that overlooks and over, uh, excuse me, oversees these risk processes. Everything from credit risk, market risk, uh, liquidity risk, duration risk, uh, borrower concentration risk, and I think you can see here on the screen uh, an overview of what some of these mean. Um, and concentration risk is probably the one uh, that should be most concerning to folks from what I've seen in the market right now, where it appears that several of our competitors uh, have massive uh, exposure, way too high exposure to one or two borrowers that could bring down the entire company. Um, and uh, duration risk means if you have via Abra's terms of service, seven day access to your funds, how long is the average loan that Abra is doing? Right? Because if the average loan is six months, then there's no way that we can give all of you seven-day access to your funds. So we manage the, the blended duration that is in line with your access to funds. And so um, then there's liquidity risk. And as I mentioned, market risk. We have a very rigorous underwriting process that uh, people go through, uh, not only the companies, but the owners of uh, companies themselves.